what is the calculated neutral load for a 1500 square foot home with an 1100 watt dishwasher, a 9 kW range, a 35 watt water heater, and a 5 kW dryer on a 122 40 volt service? I'm putting in here that the loads are calculated using the standard method. Okay, so first we're going to figure out our VAs per square foot. We've learned this already. This is our basic load calculation. If you are catching this um, in the middle, I have an entire 10-week free course that teaches you how to do all the things leading up to this. It's absolutely free. would love for you to check it out. So we have 1,500 square foot multiplied by three VAs per square foot. That's going to give us 4,500 square foot VAs. Now we have to remember our small appliance and laundry circuits. So that's going to be two small appliance and one large laundry circuit. Both of those are calculated at 1,500 each. That's going to give us 4,500 VAs for those. That's going to give us 9,000 VAs. Now we need to do our demand factors for the first portion of our load calculation. So step one, we have the first 3,000 at 100%. Step two, we do the next 301 up to 120,000 um, at 35%, uh, which is going to allow you to do another 117,000 total at this 35%. And then step three, we're going to add those back together. Okay, so we take 9,000 for step one. We're going to minus the 3,000 that we need to do at 100%. That's going to give us 6,000. Now we take that remaining 6,000. We're going to multiply that by 0.35. And that's going to give us 2,100 VAs. Now we need to add those back together. We take 3,000 and we add 2,100. And that's going to give us 5,100 total general square foot and small appliance laundry circuit VAs for this load calculation. All right, now that we've done our demand factors, we need to go back and recalculate our loads. So essentially, we're going to calculate all of the 110 loads. And we are going to do a reduction on the dryer and the range um, because of the nature of the device and uh, its neutral current. So our general square foot VAs were 5,100. Our dishwasher is 1,200. Our water heater is zero. It's a straight 240 appliance. All right, I want to take a minute here to explain why we do not count straight 240 appliances. So when we're calculating the neutral load and um, you know the question includes circuits that are straight 240, no neutral. We're not going to count that at all in the load calculation because there's no neutral current coming back on that. We just have the two hots and an equipment ground. So any straight 220 appliance, we're not gonna count in the neutral load calculation. Our range is going to be, we're gonna go to table uh, 220.55 and uh, our range in our calculation was nine, but we are gonna select from column C and everyone in between eight and 12 is going to be um, you know, eight uh, KVA. And we learned about that in a previous lesson if you haven't learned all about range calculations. I wanna take a minute and, and let you know that we're getting ready to apply a 0 0.70 demand factor to the range and the dryer because there is a code that allows us to do that. If you've not seen the full video of the bonus week one, it explains how we arrived at that 0.70. I'll put a link in the description below. But now we get to take that 8,000 and do a 70% reduction on the neutral load. So we can take 8 multiplied by 0 0.70, and that is going to give us 5,600. Now we take our dryer and we do the same thing. We know that with the standard method, it is a minimum of 5,000 or the nameplate. In our question, it was 5,000. So we just use 5,000 multiplied by 0 0.70. That's going to give us uh, the neutral calculated load of 3,500 VAs. So we're going to total those all together, and then we're going to divide by 240. So we're going to use basic Ohm's law, what we've learned before. Uh, we're going to we're trying to achieve amperage, so we divide our watts, which is our VAs. We're going to divide that by the system voltage, which is 240 in this case, and that is going to give us 64.1666. You're going to round down to 64 amps total for your neutral connected load. I want to thank you for joining us today. Please take a moment, hit that subscribe and like button and hit the notification bell button. That way you can be alerted every time we drop some new content. Thank you guys and let's get to it.